Good morning, we're with Wendy Davis Herlihy, one of our stage stop vets here today. Wendy also has extensive experience in the stage stop. Why don't you tell us a little bit about that, Wendy? Oh, good morning. Oh, good morning, <laughs> it's still dark out. Yeah, we're in um, Big Piney. Yeah, yeah. Um... Let's see, I started uh, in dogs, I don't even know the year, 2000 maybe. Uh, I was a guide for a couple years, two or three years, actually with Jerry Sidoris and his team's on the trail this time. Um, shortly thereafter, I ran into and met um, Lloyd and Mary Gilbertson and they kind of took me under their wing and showed me all there is to know about dog racing. And I raced their team for, gosh, Jerry, seven years. There was a gap in there. Mm -hmm, mm -hmm. Um, Anyway, uh, this yeah, it's is, like here she is. She's back. I'm back 10 years later. Uh, this is my favorite race as a musher, so I'm super tickled to be back here. Um, and uh, I raced it from, I think, 04 through 09 and with one gap year in there. We mm -hmm. won it in 07 and came close a few times, and I learned a lot along the way. So uh, I ended up going to veterinary school in, um, what year did I start? 09. Anyway, the dog sort of led me there. Uh, trying to figure out what I what I wanted to do and I grew up and uh, took a look at what did I love about dog mushing and the heart of it was I, I just really loved taking care of the dogs. So it, it really was uh, a way into deciding to go to vet school. And then now I practice a kind of medicine, we call it rehab medicine, so it's all about pain management. Um, I do a lot of acupuncture and chiropractic work um, and a lot of dogs and it, it, the whole gamut, right? We do sporting dogs. We also do like the old geriatrics and surgery dogs and neurologic dogs. So turns out I, I do like the old guys too, not just the sporting dogs, but it's fun to be back here. Well, great, yeah. great. We're glad to have you. It's just sad you can't, uh, you're only gonna be with, with us one more day, right? I know, through Lander. I'm hoping next year to come the whole time. Duty calls, huh? <laughs> I know, yeah. Tell us a little bit about your family. Uh, I'm married to Steve. He is an attorney um, and I have a four-year-old daughter, Finley. She really wanted to come this year, so I'm just sending her pictures. Hi, Finley. <laughs> um, yeah, she's uh, really into the work I do in dogs, which is fun. So um, she likes to get in all my, my bags and poke around and sit in on visits sometimes. <laughs> yeah, because I do house calls. Oh, wow. Yeah, so sometimes people come to my home. So Wow, it sounds like you have away. quite an extensive practice there. Yeah, it's, uh, it's, just, it's just me, but it's busy and... Um, yeah, once I get clients, they sort of they stay with me for years, so uh, it's easy to sort of fill up. Well, great. Yeah. Where are you located? I'm in Golden, Colorado. Okay, yeah. and you like it there? I do. I do. It's getting a little crowded. Sometimes Steve and I talk about coming back to Wyoming. It, it does feel like home here, honestly. When we come back, it's like a breath of fresh air. We come up in the summer a lot to climb mm -hmm. um, still, and we have friends up here, of course, still. And um, yeah, Colorado's lovely. It's just a little bit crowded, like dealing with traffic and stuff like that. Yeah, yeah. that's true. Yeah. Well, we're sure glad to have you back, Wendy. Welcome aboard. Oh, thanks, Jerry.